This is item number 40 on the released spring 2014 test items from the Tennessee end of course algebra 1 test. The question says Hector tossed an object up in the air while standing on a platform. The graph shows the height of the object above the ground as a function of time. The beautiful thing about this question to me is it's not really something that you have to do a lot of number crunching. You can just kind of look and get an answer to it. It's just about interpreting. Based on the graph, which estimate is closest to the height in meters of the object at exactly two seconds? So all you have to do is read the label. Here's two seconds, and then you just go up right in here. Here's the amount. It's between 14 and 16. So, 15. And that is it. So, just use your judgment to go up, but don't fall for something ridiculous and say, well, it's always the highest point in 16. That's where this answer comes in. People not paying attention to the question. Read the question, and it's a really easy question to get right. As I've gone through this test, I realize that many of the questions, if you just read them, are actually pretty simple, um, but don't just, well, it's got a graph, so forget it. Make sure that you have the you know, the graph labels, the axis labels in your head about what they mean, and then you should be fine. That's it.